Weekend's uh, hard. Uh, Doris, Mike, and all the staff has been working. And Leonard have been working real hard on this card. They put a great card. Got some great fights. Um, you know, since since first, because we really don't have any fighters under contract, so we just try to put on the very best fights that we can. So um, come out Saturday night. There's uh, plenty of tickets still available. Uh, you know, come, come out and cheer the locals. We got a lot of local guys. Holly will be out there, and um, come on out sat Saturday night. Uh, tickets at uh, route66.com. Um, also, I'd like to thank Laguna Development uh, for uh, hosting us there at Route 66. I'd like to thank Jerry Smith, the CEO, uh, Kevin Greer, the COO, uh, Skip, uh, and all the other staff. Howie from Route 66 is here. Thank you, Howie, for coming out and helping us out. Our sponsors for this event is the Budweiser, Jack Daniels, um, Max taking the rope in, in this event is under the auspice of the New Mexico Athletic Commission. Um, we're really excited about Saturday. Uh, I'm going to let Mike introduce the fighters because he knows a heck of a lot more about this than I do and to give you some little bit of what's going on with each camp and stuff like that. So um, I'd like to introduce the my partner and the best trainer in the world, Mike Winkadon. Hey guys, thanks for coming out. First, I got, to tell, I got a big group of guys here. I, uh, first, I want to let you guys know I, I train some of the guys over here, but every one of you guys, you guys got guts to do something like this. Get out there and fight and stuff. So I, I, I respect you guys for what you do, and we're going to be as professional as possible. We'll run a professional show. Um, and uh, I know you guys came here to fight. So what I want to do is let everybody know who the fighters are and have the fighters come up and say something. Um, so hopefully these, these are the people are right here. So in the first fight of the night, I want to start with uh, Kenneth Brown out of uh, Martinez. Walter. Yes. Kenneth, come on. Thank you. My name is Kenneth Brown, and I'm fighting for Martinez and Sisters, and also for Bone Crusher out of Las Cruces. I'm fighting from Roswell, New Mexico, and be here August 6th to fight Ray Visor. Um, pretty much been conditioning in the camp. James has been getting our butt whooped into shape and getting everything in order. And I'm here to give you all a show. It's going to be a fight. Come out and see it. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, fighting out of Socorro, New Mexico. Ray and Ray, I'll make sure I get your name right. Is it Visa? Yes, sir. All right. Yeah. That was luck. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. My name is Ray Visa. I'm fighting out of Socorro, New Mexico. But I train out of uh, Team Lookouts. I'm just I'm excited to be here, you know what I mean? This is a big card, you know, it's for Frescas. And I know James real well. He's a real respectful guy, you know what I mean? So just looking forward to fighting. It's going to be a good fight, man. Yeah. All right. Hey guys, guys, come on, do the pose up right here for the cameras real fast. Yeah. Please. Fight of the night, it's going to be uh, Brandon Trujillo and Julio Zapata. Both guys aren't here, so we're going to go to the third fight of the night. Um, fighting out of, this, out of our gym here, Chris Rojas. Come up, Chris. How's it going? My name is Chris Rojas. I'm fighting here out of Jackson Week MMA. Um, you no, know, I worked hard for this fight. Um, much respect to Martinez and uh, Nate for taking the fight, man. Um, it's going to be a barn burner. Expect you guys all to be there. Thank you. Thank you, Chris. Uh, Saturday night, guys, is going to be Nate Gomez out of Martinez. Um, Nate Gomez, um, the first fight. I'm very proud to be stepping into this cage, uh, especially with with Jackson Wings guy. Um, 
and just really excited. Um, can't wait to step in there and give everybody a good show. Guys, the amateur fights, these guys just throw down this grab. Those most exciting <laughs> fights, you know. Guys, come up and do, do a pose off real fast. Thanks. Next up, we have Matthew Gonzalez and Ian Velasquez scrapping it out. Uh, Matthew Gonzalez, he's he's out of Martinez. Come on up, man. Hello, how you guys doing? I'm Matthew, and I'm fighting out of Martinez Inc. Obviously, and uh, me and my camp, we've been working really hard for this fight, and uh, I'm ready for my best against Ian's best, and it's going to be a great fight. Thank you. Ian Velasquez, come on up. Did you hear? I'm right in. Oh, down there. Oh, side the table. Sorry, sir. Uh, my name is Ian Velasquez. I train out of Takamai Karate. Um, like, just like Matt said, we're working hard. And I uh, hope we put on a show for you guys on Saturday. Thank you. Ladies coming in here. Alida Alviar at Las Cruces, and she's fighting uh, um, Andrea Amaro at Las Cruces. Alida, come on up. Okay. Hello, everybody. My name is Alida Avalar from Las Cruces, New Mexico. I am too fighting out of Martinez E. Um, I'm making my MMA debut. Um, I plan to put on a good fight. I too have been working very hard, so I plan to be. I hope you all are there. I plan to put on a good show. So thank you. Okay guys, here we go with the pros. Uh, we got Ricky Esquivel fighting Levi Lucero. Levi's at a lookout gym here in town. Ricky's at this gym here. Levi, why don't you come up and say a few words. How's it going? I'm Levi Lucero. I'm fighting in the out of lookout Spanish Family Systems. Um, I'm happy to be here. I'm ready to put on the show. Yeah. Ready to win so I can eat. I'm hungry. <laughs> and Ricky, I want to see he's always smiling. Esquivel, come on up, Ricky. Okay. Nice. Hey, how, how's everyone doing? Uh, my name is Ricky Esquivel. I'm here to have fun. That's the most important thing. Like little John Dotson always says, if you're not having fun, why do it? So Saturday night, I'll have fun, put on a show, and Guys, they each have one fight at 145 pounds. We've got Henry Barahona, Barahona and, and Casey Yates. Casey, come on up. My name is Casey Yates. I'm fighting out of lookouts. Uh, excited for Saturday night. Henry's a great guy, great opponent, so it'll be fireworks for the fight. So come out and see us. Hey, Henry, come on up. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Henry Barona. I train here in the best gym in the world, Jackson Weeks. I'm um, trying to get that first pro win. Look, look for an exciting fight. Thank you. Hey. 
uh, yeah, here's the seven main event, guys. It's Conrad Padilla out of our, uh, my gym here fighting Cody. Face Cody off. Oh, oh pose off, pose off, pose off. <laughs> Towards us. Thank you. Right, I'm going to do this again, guys. Uh, Conrad Padilla, he's fighting Cody Walker, semi main event. Um, Conrad's been doing a long time. I don't know if I was with you in your first, first fight or not, Conrad, but it's been many years and stuff. Anyway, if you guys watch Conrad Padilla fight, it's always a war. Oh, heads are always bouncing around and stuff, so it's really exciting. I'm not really happy about that side of it all the time, but uh, Conrad's fighting Cody. He's not here. Conrad, come on up. That's the word, sir. Conrad, come on up. Come on up. Hello, Conrad Padilla. I want to thank uh, Mr. Fresquez, uh, 66 Casino, and all the support, and um, putting on a great show. Um, I'm excited because this is the first time in a long time that I've actually got to fight two times in the same year, so... Uh, Hey man, just come on out, support uh, local local talent, local MMA. You don't know who the next world champion is up here yet. You know what I mean? You just uh, don't blink, and I'm sure every fight will be exciting. So come on out. Any questions? No. You know what happened to Chevy Bridges? Do you know? Um, as far as I know, he uh, he got injured, and um, I think this is a good change. Uh, most of my most of my training partners are already six one, so this ought to be. You know, it's uh, just like another day, day in the office, you know, go out there and uh, put on a good show like always. And, you know, our game plan never changes. Go out there and just make it a mess like I always do. That's it. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, man, man of the night. Guys, we got... Uh my own fighter, Isaac Valley Flag, uh, he's been in the UFC. He's fought at the highest level, guys. He, he, he comes, very talented guy. And Jonathan Gary, coming in from Oklahoma City. Mr. Gary, uh, we're, we're glad to have you here. Uh, and Jonathan, I watched a lot of tape on him to tell Mike out with his fight, and, and this man can go. So it's a scary fight, there's no doubt about it. Um, he's got real slick moves and stuff. I want Jonathan to come on up and say a few words here. Jonathan Gary, just an old country boy from Oklahoma, pretty much. Just come here. I just want to thank Bassett's Promotions, Doris Robinson, everybody, Isaac Valify for even giving me the fight. Because, I mean, it's really hard to get fights where I'm from, you know. It's not that many people. It's a small town in Oklahoma, you know. So, just come over here, put on a good show, and just make it bloody if I can, you know. All right, anybody got any questions? Uh, tell me, how much notice have you had, and what do you know about it? Oh, I only had it on a month notice. I had him shorter. It doesn't matter if fight is a fight. But Isaac, you gotta give it to him, man. The guy's been there, he's done that. Hey, he paved the way for me to even get in here. So, hey, you gotta give a buck to him, you know. I just wanna say, hey man, thank you for paving the way, even though this is his last fight, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, a lot of people make you know different changes there now and then, but hey, I just wanna say he paved the way for all of us up here, so so thank you. Man. Isaac Valley Fly, over and above the fact that uh, he's been a fighter and all that really important stuff, he's got a couple schools. He runs a couple of Jackson's MMA schools here in town. So, businessman, entrepreneur, and he's out there teaching a lot of kids to do this for proper values. So, hopefully, you know, uh, all the students are coming out to watch the fights as well. And uh, people see what kind of big heart he has helping others. Isaac, come on up. So, uh, first off, I want to thank Fresco's Productions for having me on the card. Uh, it's an honor to fight time. It's a card for me. Uh, I want to thank Jonathan. You know, he stepped up when another guy uh, pulled out of the fight, so I appreciate that he did that. You know, uh, I appreciate anybody who's willing to step in, to, especially on shorter notice and come fight. You know, and, uh, it shows what kind of person they are in general. You know, uh, Jonathan's a tough guy. Uh, I'm okay, I guess. I'm not that tough. But we're probably going to fight a little bit. And uh, everybody said they're going to put on a good show, and I guess we are too. Uh, uh, you know, I I'm excited about this. This is my last my last fight, but, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just kind of, uh, I'm excited to 
and I have to diet anymore and to, uh, to kind of move on to the next phase of, uh, of, of my martial arts career. So this is, uh, it's cool to be able to, to have my last fight here at home and then, uh, then kind of move on. Uh, uh, you know, looking at Jonathan and his fighting style, I guarantee this will be a fun fight to watch. You know, see me fight, you know, none of my fights are boring. Uh, so, you know, we're going to, yeah. we both are coming out to, to really put on a show and hopefully I think you guys, thank you guys for coming out. Guys, thanks for coming. I let you guys know tickets are out there. Uh, get your tickets as soon as you get them, the better seats you get. So go buy your tickets real fast. Um, or we hope always we always hope for a sellout. The big amateur card, so they have a tendency to bring a lot of families. So uh, get those tickets right away. But on a side note, I want to thank Mr. Fresquez for throwing fights. Uh, everybody down here is like, wow, I only fought Conrad. I didn't know that Conrad. You only fought one time a year before this. That, that tells you how, how hard it is to throw fights and monetize this thing. So this man's a genius to be able to put it together because he always throws professional fights, so um, I want to tell him thank you because I've built a lot of fighters with this man over the years. Anyway, thanks for coming out, guys. Come to the fights.